Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. I'm JS for Pop Productions. Now you can also tell from the title down below. And please don't question me on this, okay? I I want the, this month to be very settled. So for today, I am gonna be making a peanut butter and jelly sandwich with a twist. I don't know why I'm doing it. So with that being said, let's get right on to the video. So if I'm gonna make a peanut butter and jelly sandwich, I obviously need this plate. I'm gonna need bread, need some jelly, need some peanut butter, and for the final ingredient that I plan to put on this peanut butter and jelly sandwich is uh, chocolate spread, but in this case it's called hazelnut spread, you know what I'm saying? Okay, first off, what you're gonna need to do, grab, wait, what? Yeah, we're gonna grab two pieces of bread, right? Put it on the plate, open the jelly, right? And you're gonna do one tablespoon of jelly. Put it on your bread like that. Use the spoon to sp spread that jelly, you know what I'm saying? You're gonna do it like that. Yeah. Does that look yummy to you guys? I don't know. You're just gonna watch my video and find out. Yeah. Spread that jelly. Next up, we're gonna get the peanut butter, right? And don't worry, it's the skippy kind. And we're gonna do one half spread on the, well, is it half a spread? I don't know. But we're gonna take the peanut butter, put it on only one half of, one half, oh God, I can't speak right. One side of the bread, and well, we're gonna put that put that away, you know what I'm saying? We don't, we don't want to waste, you know? Save money a little bit of Walmart, you know what I'm saying? Next is we're gonna use we're gonna open a chocolate, the hazelnut spread. Okay, wait, hold up, hold up, hold up. And now we're just gonna stir it out a little bit, you know what I'm saying? We don't want that to uh, be all liquidy. We just want one good swoop. So I'm just gonna do like one knife spread or whatever you call it. You know what? Actually, guys, tell me in the comments down below. There, we could do like half a tablespoon. So what is this called, huh? Like. One half of a knife spread? I don't, I don't, I don't, I'm sorry, I'm, oh God, okay. Well, the, uh, okay, well chocolate spread is a nuisance. So, uh, but this is just a, I just wanna see what this would be like, you know what I'm saying? Oh, wait, 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 wait. We don't, we wanna save that money, you know what I'm saying? Okay, now, let me put that away. Now, for the final thing, we're gonna put it all together. Yeah, make it look like a natural sandwich. I'm gonna, we're not gonna cut half, we're gonna cut it like this. So it would look amazing, you know what I'm saying? Oh, 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 oh. Look at that, look at that sandwich, man. See that sandwich? Oh, that's the homie right there. Let me, let me lick my knife. Mm. Mm. Oh, that chocolate though. And that is how you make a peanut butter and jelly sandwich with chocolate spread or hazelnut spread. I, I don't care, but that is a sandwich, a fortified sandwich. Peanut butter and jelly sandwich with a twist. Look at that. Oh my God. It's like random tasting all over again. And it got really messy if you can obviously tell from that chocolate stain. Oh my God. Okay. Well. Enough of that, you're about to witness me having peanut butter and jelly and chocolate spread looking liquid thing all together. Let's go. Wait, wait, let me try the chocolate side now. Hmm. You know what, it's not that bad. Bagels and jelly. <laughs> Chocolate and jelly. I see you. Okay. 
Hmm. Yeah, very interesting taste. I sure hope you guys like the video. Please put a comment down below because I know you will. If not, don't worry, I understand. And be sure to subscribe to my channel. Oh my god. Okay. Yeah, like, comment, subscribe. I'm JS45 Productions. Stay fortified.